Layer Render is a layer level render engine for After Effects. The current version is only available on Windows. A Mac version will be out soon. Apply Layer Render to its own adjustment layer. The free version is functional. The files that you will get do not have a watermark, but the codex presets and codec options will be grayed out so you can only render to H.264. Once it's activated, everything is available and it functions as a really fast and convenient layer level render engine. Drag the in and out points of the layer render adjustment layer to figure out the in and out points of your layer that has to be rendered and make sure that the playhead is parked on the active part of the layer render adjustment layer. Start render, select your file, and if your comp resolution is not set to 100%, you'll get this error. So, make sure this is set to full. Right, that's done. It's actually really fast. And in the examples that I've used it for, it ends up being faster than the inbuilt After Effects render engine. Click on register, look through the EULA, and when you're ready, click next. Now the data field, the yellow fields are optional and the green fields are compulsory. Enter your license, click next, and the license is activated. You'll need to restart After Effects. Now when you click on Layer Render, you'll find that the codex presets and codec options have been enabled. Click on Register and you'll see that the license is active. The codex field gives you a choice of 6, VP9, H.264, H.265, DNX HD, Cineform, and ProRes. And each one of them come with, with an extensive set of presets. Separate audio generates a separate WAV file with the same root name as your video file in the same directory. The codec options gives you a lot more flexibility in terms of the file that you wish to render. Here you have direct access to the command that FFmpeg is going to see. Don't worry about the delay option. You can choose the FFmpeg binary. Now start the render and let's say it's uh, test2.move. And it's done. The advantage of layer render compared to other render engines or plugins is that it is the only one in the market that allows you to render from inside your comp. So if you've got a complicated composition with uh, say 10 or 20 uh, different levels, uh, this is an easy way to send out samples to your client. Uh, it's also more convenient as compared to the render queue because you essentially just send it out immediately and the whole thing is done. Thank you.